Hi guys, PD here. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to another new video. I've got a really nice surprise today, guys. Lucky's Tale has been released on the Oculus Quest 2. For those of you who don't know, this was an original exclusive title on the Rift CV1. Some of you might recognise the name as well because Super Lucky's Tale was released as a flat platforming game on the consoles. I loved this game when it first came out on the Rift CV1 guys, it is one of the first platforming games I tried in VR and it was amazing. I'm hoping it still stands the test of time, really looking forward to this one. A big thank you to the developers for this review key, let's dive in. Whoa. Playful! Hello Lucky! Okay guys, we're inside the game. This looks amazing. This looks just like it did on the uh, Rift CV1 four or five years ago. I'm getting some really fuzzy nostalgia feelings here. This game guys was amazing. I love this game. My kids love the game. I'm super excited. It's now on the Quest 2. This really looks awesome guys. It really does. And this is one of the first platforming games I tried in VR. As you can see, I'm actually inside the game world. This is like uh, all around me. Look, I can spin around. The world's behind me. The uh, sense of scale and depth is amazing. I can see the fish in the water. I can see the depth of the water. Enough about me gushing, guys. Let's jump into the game. Okay, so press the A button to start. Belly flop. Options, tail swipe, throw. Let me uh, check out the options menu. Okay, English language. Okay. Lucky and Piggy are the best of friends. They curl up to sleep when the day ends. But the Lord crept in, looking for a treat. And took Mr. Piggy as something to eat. No, not Mr. Piggy. Leave him alone. You naughty Trifford. Piggy gave a yelp, and Lucky leapt from bed. Off to help. I'm coming, Piggy! I'm coming! As the wily glory fled, a golden coin trail showed him the way. This is Lucky's Tale, and it's time to play. Okay, guys, I'm noticing things I don't remember seeing on the Rift CV1. So I don't know if they've added like new stuff to the game. But here we go. Hello Lucky. So this is a classic platforming game guys. I can't get over how amazing this looks. I really can't. Okay so use your thumbstick to move look. Classic controls for a platformer. Run jump. I'm going to jump on the mushrooms. Grab all the coins. This game is all about finding coins. There's some hidden ones here look. Jump on the crates and we can belly flop on them. Let me just check over here. There's a crate over here, look. A little secret here. Oh, there's some diamonds as well, so grab the diamonds. Belly flop onto the uh, boxes. Grab the hidden ones here. Sometimes you can jump on the bushes and there, there's hidden gems on the bushes. If you like games like Crash Bandicoot, Super Mario, then this is perfect. I'm really impressed with the graphics guys. For me, this is one of the best Quest 2 titles I've seen. That was interesting. Um, I got a butterfly and I got some coins. I did not know that. Let me try and grab this butterfly here. Oh, you get bonus coins from the butterflies. 
this looks better than what I remember playing on the Rift CV1 guys and the reason why it looks so much better there's no more screen door I remember the first time I tried this game it looked amazing it looks just the same but I could see the screen doors on the Rift CV1 on the Quest 2 guys this is super sharp crystal clear let me just check all these uh, bushes now I'm finding things I did not know existed sometimes there'll be coins hidden behind bushes so Okay, grab all the butterflies. Come here. Got him. Okay, so we've been up here. Let me try to get onto the top here. And um, Lucky does have like a spin attack. You press down the uh, top one there, look. It does like a spin attack. Let me just check for any secrets hidden coins they've really put a lot of thought into this game as well guys look at this look when I hit the uh, dandelion seeds here look that's an awesome effect Choo. Choo. we need to whack this guy hit him to get all the diamonds Grab them all before they disappear. Okay, there's hidden coins on top of the signpost. Look, let me do a double jump. Now, if you fall into the water, guys, you lose a life. So just make sure you don't fall off the uh, off the end into the water. Okay, we did it. Some coins down here, look, let me grab all the coins. It's always a good idea to check everywhere, guys. Around the back here, look. Some down here. Okay, let's get on to here. So this is showing me how to do like a double jump. Okay, hit the boxes, grab all the coins. The uh, controls are really responsive, guys. It feels just like a, a normal platforming game would feel. Jump onto the mushrooms. Hit the ball. <laughs> Okay, first bad guy, we need to uh, whack him. Don't let him touch you guys. Whack him. Pick up the ball. And that's showing you how to uh, throw the ball up. Checkpoint. I've just picked up an extra health. He looks amazing, guys. It really does. Let me try and grab the butterfly. There we go. Okay, so we can go up this way or we can go this way. Now this way there's a little secret area. I do believe this is the way we need to go, so let me head up here. Close little ball. Hello. Okay, we're going to jump up here. Lots of butterflies here, look. And there's a hidden diamond here. 2,000 points for that. I got butterflies in my face. I bet he wasn't expecting me to say that today. So the developers of this game have kept this um, version secret for a while now. And I've been super excited to um, show it to you guys because this is amazing. For me, this is what VR is all about. These worlds are stunning. They look amazing. 
Okay, we're going to try and grab these gems here. Oh, I missed it. So let me go back up. Let me break all the boxes, grab all the coins. Yes! I found a bonus character as well. Grab the butterfly, grab the coin. Jump back up here and let me try to grab this big diamond here. 2,000 points. Okay, this bit's really interesting, guys. We go in here a lot. Now it takes you into this 3D classic platforming type diorama look. This is all in 3D, guys. So let me let me whack everything. Grab the coins. That's telling me to hit the switch. I'm just going to whack everything, hit the mushrooms. I'm looking for secrets. Grab all the coins. Grab the diamond. And jump back out again. Okay, kill the uh, caterpillars. Don't let them jump on you. So we went in there. And we came out here. Okay, hidden diamond seal up. Check behind this bush if I can. Let me check around here. Oh, there we go. Secret coin right in the corner. Yeah, there's a really nice sense of depth here as well. Scale and depth. Let me just check around here. I think that's it. On to uh, the next level. <laughs> Come, on. Come on! Okay, coins behind here, look. I love the waterfall over there. This game's got a really great atmosphere. Really well done. And it's probably one of my favourite um, platforming games of all time. Okay, so we need to hit A and then right trigger. Do like a smash attack. Grab all the coins. If you've got any siblings in your family, they're probably going to love this game. Let me grab all the butterflies. I don't remember getting coins from the uh, butterflies. Maybe that's something I missed on the PC version. Okay, can we smash that? Into the level. Mind the light. <laughs> Kill the Triffid. Grab Mr. Alarm Clock. Okay, so this is like a timed event. Grab all those quick. We did it. Get the big one at the end. And then I'm going to go back. I'm going to go back and make sure I've not missed anything, guys. Look, there's hidden coins here. Smash the light. There's one on top of the light. Some eggs here. We can throw the eggs. There are targets in the game. I can't see any target yet. You have to throw the eggs at the targets. <laughs> Hello, Chick Chick. <laughs> He's so cute. Check around the back of the tree. Okay. Good to go. Now, there's some chickens below me, so I can either go down or I can go across. We can always come back, guys. 
discover all these secrets here. As soon as my son knows I've got this game on the Quest 2, this is all he's going to want to play. He played this game to death on my Rift CV1. He loved it. Okay, we've got some little frogs in here now, look. Okay, we fell in the water and died. I've lost a life. So this does not feel like a port. It feels like it's native to the Quest 2. Performance is amazing. Okay, I missed those. Okay, so we've made it down below the bridge now where I wanted to be. There's like a hidden parcel there. Can I go and grab that? Shoot, 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 shoot. Okay, jump on the trees, try to grab this parcel. Got it. You found a parcel, press Y in the storybook to view your presence. So when you've completed a level, guys, you get like a storybook. Look at these guys, so cute. Hidden coins here on the edge. Okay, I missed one, let me go back. Just jump on the caterpillar. Okay, big jump. I missed some coins there a lot. Here we go. I would say this is one of those experiences to show people new to VR. It's going to blow them away. Grab the extra life. Hit the light. Grab the coin on the top. Hello. Okay, this is uh, awesome. I love this bit, guys. These fish actually jump into your face. <laughs> it's pretty funny. That hit my uh, headset. Free the bird. Kill the triffid. Check for secret coins. Okay, we're going to run up the wall. Just keep double jumping on the wall. Coins here, look. Let me check around the back here. Lots of butterflies here. So collecting coins from butterflies might be a new feature, guys. I really don't remember grabbing these on the Rift CV1. Come here. Yep, got him. Must catch them all. Checkpoint. And we will be going this way, but we need to uh, knock down the bridge, so we're going over here, mind the uh, obstacles. Okay, I'm going to check around the outside first. So this is where you pick up objects and you use your headset to aim at the targets. Pretty cool look. 
I'm aiming with my head and then you throw blow up the targets get the big diamond okay let me check around here that's a long way down I love these views I'm being in the actual world nothing beats it guys look at that rock balancing over there there's like a really awesome rainbow in the sky the level design is perfect guys it really is perfect do, 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 do. Okay, avoid the bees. Try to kill the bees. Free the egg. Hello, chick chick. Okay, some diamonds right up here. Can I do a double jump? There's one. This world is so alive, you've got like uh, dust particles, there's like fireflies around the lamps, you've got birds everywhere, leaves falling from the trees, superb guys. I was already a big fan of this game but on the quest 2 guys, 5 out of 5. Kill the bee. Okay, timer. Mind the spikes on the hedgehog. Ouch. I lost the life there. Okay, let's try and get onto this box. There's a big diamond to fill up. Hiding away. Okay, any on this post? Nope. Look at the fish. This is really cool, guys, to watch the fish jump over here. Let me come back a little bit. Come on, Lucky. Let's watch the fish. No, he didn't make it. Can I grab a fish? I can hit the fish. I can't pick them up. <laughs> awesome. Okay, we need to jump on here. Grab the rope. Climb up the rope. We made it, guys. We got to the balloon. That's the end of level one, I do believe. Bye, Lucky. Okay, guys, so this is the main menu hub. And this is where you unlock your presence. Press the Y. Okay, press A to open. Chapter 1, Leaving Home. I've got a little, um, like, trophy there. Look, he's riding a pig. That's awesome. I love the art style, guys. Okay, so, story mode. I've got a high score. Oh, you can actually touch the book with your hand. Okay, so I did not find the red coins, it looks like. So this is level one, leaving home. If I hit that arrow there, I can now move on to level two, guys. I'm going to show you a bit of level two, guys, and then I'll end the video. The rainbow forest. Here we go, this is the rainbow forest.
You should always jump on top of the box first, guys, in case there's any hidden coins above you. Okay, there's a rock monster here. We need to try and kill him. He looks amazing. I lost the life there, but... There we go, you see? Jumping on the boxes, I discovered some hidden coins. I love the kite as well. There's like a windmill over there. Hello. If you've never seen a platform game in VR, guys, you really are missing out. Jump up here. And I love how the camera just floats up to your level. Okay, these guys we need to jump on here, we need to whack them from the side. Like that. Okay, I want to go this way first, then I need to... Some coins heal up. I got all the coins, so you don't have to jump on these, you can just crawl as well. Look. I was double jumping up here. Either way it works. Now this is something I'm going to be showing friends in VR. And it's going to make them want to buy a Quest 2. If you know somebody who's got a Wii guys, this is the perfect game for them. They're going to love it. Okay, I've got full health again. Got the time. Okay, I'm on a time limit to smash all these. Into the bonus hole. Okay, this is a dark level. It's quite dark in here. Look at that guy knocking down the boxes. That's awesome. He's still alive. Okay, I can't kill him. I don't think I can kill that one. He just um, dazes him a lot. There's a coin right here in this corner. Coins in the corner here and over here. I nearly missed those. Up we go. Okay, we're back here. Um, there's a present up here. Let me grab the present behind the tree. Okay, we're going to try and jump on the birds and make our way across here. Not quite. Okay, can we do that again? It's quite tricky to um, jump across. I don't know if the uh, bird's going to respawn. We did it. I am a platform master. Let's jump down here, look. Okay, we died, guys. Poor Lucky. I've got six lives left. Okay, guys, I'm going to leave it there. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Do yourself a favour, you need this game in your life, it's amazing. I'm going to die again. Superb game guys, it really is. Okay, hit the switch. Oh, where do you come from? 
on here. Onto the uh, bonus island here, look. Okay, hit the uh, hedgehogs. Wait for them to shed their spikes. Whack a mole. Grab the coins. I would probably say this game is probably best played sat down as well. You can play the game standing up, guys, but this is the type of game I would play seated. And we died again. See you later, guys. Bye.